Adam Wilcox here with RochesterFoodNet.com. It's Cheap Lunch Friday, and we're in Greece, not the country, but the suburb, at Philly Steakout. This is not Philadelphia, but this is the Philly Steakout, and I assume they have, you know, steak sandwiches and stuff. It's been here a long, long time. A lot of people really like it a lot. Let's check it out. I got the, the Philly Classic with onions and Swiss cheese. Uh, steak sauce. <laughs> very tasty. I don't eat beef very often, which is good. So this is a meal that requires lots of napkins, see? They call this the Philly Classic, which is uh, the shaved steak cooked up on a roll with peppers and onions, whatever else you want. I got it with hot and sweet peppers, mushrooms I got, and uh, I, they asked if I wanted sauce. I said, what do you recommend? They said, we like the hot sauce right on it, so that's a, a Rochester sauce, a meat sauce on there. That's probably not something they do in Philadelphia, but I don't know that. And over here we've got a chicken parm sandwich. Sauce and uh, probably provolone cheese or mozzarella cheese. Yeah, mozzarella's provolone. I think it's provolone. Maybe. I'm not sure. You can customize these things with whatever you want. They got a big thing of ketchup for pouring that out. They got dill pickles you can grab. That's more of the hot sauce because I'm thinking I'm going to want that. Onion rings and of course you got the French fries. <laughs> Nicely cooked, crisp on the outside. Philly veggie, I think they call it veggie Philly. It's. Uh, Something I'm going to have to eat with a fork, I think. Zucchini and all kinds of other things, and mozzarella cheese, and it looks wonderful. This, uh, these aren't bad. Sweet potato fries. And this is a classic Philly sandwich. What a gloppy mess. This is with Wiz. I asked them for onions and uh, hot banana peppers, and I asked them what kind of sauce to put on it. And they said, you can put whatever you want to. So what are you doing in Philly? So well, in Philly... You ask for sauce, they give you spaghetti sauce. So I didn't really want to have spaghetti sauce in here. A side of boss sauce, but this is as close as we're going to get to a classic Philly sandwich. And, of course, there's different schools of thought on Philly sandwiches, whether you use provolone or you use cheese Whiz. So for the sake of science, I chose cheese Whiz. Hopefully that is a wise choice. Many varieties of fries you can get here. So I, it, no matter what school of French fry you adhere to, you can find one that fits it. So you have sweet potato fries, you have the regular French fries, and then we have the fresh cut fries. So I mentioned that they have their own Rochester sauce here, the, the hot meat sauce. My experience is that in general, when you get the Rochester meat sauce out and they call it hot sauce, it usually isn't that hot. Sometimes it's spicy with, with you know cumin or whatever it has in it, but it's seldom actually that hot. This is quite hot. This is a hot, hot sauce, so my... my Philly Classic with hot sauce is a hot sandwich, and I'm digging it. Oh my god! <laughs> yes. It's a monster. Eggplant and green peppers and, and and spaghetti sauce. Green peppers and mushrooms and onions and that's like, you know, this is this is veggie heaven. This is good. I'm here with Mike Nasso. He's a cook here at Philly Steakout on on Long Long Pond Road. In, in Greece. So the concept here is pretty simple. Yep. Uh, authentic cheesesteaks, basically. Right, right. Like like they make them in Philly? Uh, we do them like they do in Philly, or in my case, I like to say that we do them a little better. Right? What do you have that Philly doesn't have? Uh, we got hot meat sauce here, and we make it right in. It's Rochester sauce. Yeah. It's a and good uh, one, too. It's actually hot. A lot yeah. of places it's not hot. You do several things with the potatoes. You got the regular french fries. Uh, we got regular french fries, which are normal frozen french fries. Then right. we got uh, fresh cut french fries, which we cut the potatoes and everything here and mm -hmm. cook them all here. And then we got sweet potato french fries, which they come in, uh, we do them with cinnamon or salt and however you like them. And uh, we also do onion rings and home right. fries for... Onion uh, ring is, uh, you're not making those, right? Those no, no, are, onion rings are, also come in. They're frozen product? product? Yeah, but they're good ones. Oh, so yeah, they're, they're, they're good. nicely. Our meat all comes from Triano's on Stone Road. Mm -hmm. and, and we cut that and patty it up here fresh every day. Oh, you cut it? Oh, yeah. You just buy the bulk, it, the pieces. Yeah, it comes in in big pieces and we trim all the fat off of it. Awesome. we... Slice it up and shred it every day and then patty it up. So it's fabulous. Well, it was really delicious. We had a good time. Always fresh. And we had two uh, vegetarians with us today. They really like the vegetables. Oh, yeah. We, we do the veggie. Right 
Right. Oh right. We do the veggie Philly every every day. Um, we got a fish sandwich also. We do that every day. Right, right. fries. Then you batter that yourself. Oh, uh, that or? comes in actually frozen. Uh huh. But it's it's still it. pretty good. Pretty good sandwich. Pretty good fry. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Excellent. Well, Mike, thank you so much. Yep. Thank you. I'm Mike Nasso at Philly Steakout uh, with RochesterFoodNet.com. Excellent. Don't you agree? Yeah, that is nice. Just for reference. <laughs>